This is a view of the CellSense user interface. It is to a great extent configurable so that it can easily be adapted to meet the requirements of individual users or of different tasks. You can define a so-called layout that is suitable for a task on hand. A layout is an arrangement of the control elements on your monitor that is optimal for the task on hand. In any layout, only the software functions that are important in respect to this layout will be available. Within CellSense, the elements of the layout are toolbars, tool windows, status bar, and menu bar. The list of toolbars and tool windows and menus that will be displayed are dictated by what level of cell sense is installed, as well as any additional modules that have been installed. Use the view toolbars command to make specific toolbars appear or disappear. A check mark in front of the name of the toolbar shows that this toolbar is on display. To make a toolbar appear, select a toolbar without a check next to it. To make a toolbar disappear, select one of the toolbars with a check. Tool windows combine functions into groups, and these may be very different functions. For example, in the Process Manager tool window, you can set up unique acquisition processes like time-lapse or multi-channel acquisition, while in the Camera Control tool window combines all of the functions and settings you can use with your specific camera. Which tool windows are shown by default depends on the layout you have chosen. You can at any time make specific tool windows appear or disappear manually. To do so, use the View Tool Windows command and select the tool window you would wish to show or not. The top part of every tool window is called the header. In the header, you will find three buttons, Help, Auto Hide, and Close. To close a tool window, just click on the close. When you click on Auto Hide, the tool window is minimized. Now, on the edge or the bottom of your screen, a mouse over zone appears with the icons of the tool window. As soon as you move your mouse or pointer over the tool window's icon, the tool window will be displayed. Now you can use it as usual. To disable the auto hide function, simply click on the auto hide icon again. Clicking help will bring up the program's online help tool with comprehensive information about that tool window. Tool windows can be docked, freely positioned, or integrated into document groups. However, you can only position tool windows as you wish when you are in expert mode. To enable expert mode, in the menu bar, go to Tools, Options, Environment, General, and select Expert Mode. Click OK. To move a tool window, click on its header with your left mouse button and hold it then drag it out of its docked position. You can also dock a tool window. While holding the header, you will see a number of layout placement icons. This will allow you to dock it to the left, right, top, or bottom of the program interface. If you want that tool window to show as a new tab on an existing tool window, float it over the existing tool window and then drop it on to the tabbed centered placement icon. To remove it from this dock position in the new tool window, simply click on the tab and left click and hold. Drag it out. Now you're free to place it or dock it. 
Once you have set up all of the toolbars and tool windows into a layout that you would like to easily access in the future, you should save it. To save the layout, click on Layout tab in the upper right hand corner and save current layout as. Give it a name. And then you can choose public or private if you're the program administrator. If you choose public, it will allow other users to see this layout and use it. Click Save and now your new layout will show up as an additional layout tab in the upper right hand area of the interface. To enable or disable interfaces layouts, go to Layout, Manage Layouts. Layouts that have a check mark next to them will be displayed. To change the order in which layouts are displayed, simply select a layout and hit the up or down arrows. By default, pre-configured layouts are available which have been created to help with some of the most common workflows. They are available in Layout Manage Layouts.